Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Astro Pill. Thanks for tuning in. Today, uh, we're gonna be playing a game called Lie Eat, as you can see on the screen. A little bit of context for it, a little bit of background. Um, it's a pixel game, is all I know. Uh, I guess, I think RPG Maker, I'm not super sure. Uh, it was developed by a group called Miwashiba. Um, I purchased a couple of their games, so I do kind of want to get through them. I hear they're very short and very cute. Um, and... Uh, published by Playism, who have published a lot of other games that are relevant to my interest. We've played Angels of Death on the channel that's published by them. Um, I played Mad Father and Misao back a bit back a long time ago. Not on the channel, but I, I plan to try and play it on the channel at some point in the future. So they, they uh, seem to do a lot of interesting games that are relevant to my interest. I don't know super much about this game other than you see on the screen the lie eating dragon and the vermilion vampire. I believe there's three different chapters. Let's get through it. Let's get to it. It's a rainy day today and I just want a little bit of a pick me up. So let's do it. Very cool, liking it so far. Long ago in a small town there lived a family of vampires. They were very kind souls, and got along well with the humans there. That's good. It's good to hear. Uh-oh, somebody's dying. Someone's dead. The, the vampire killed someone. But one dark night, one of the kind vampires attacked a human in town. How did I know? How did I know? Before anyone knew it, it already sucked out all of the human's blood. Why'd you have to go and do that? Now you're gonna mess up the diplomacy for everybody. The news that they had attacked a human was soon revealed to the others. The vampire was executed, and the townspeople lived happily ever after. I'm sure it didn't work out that smoothly. Are vampires real? Are they bad guys? Vampires did exist, but not anymore. And if they were bad, well, I wouldn't know. In fact, I even doubt this vampire attacked their victim willingly. It's getting late. You should get to bed. Why can't we all sleep together? If you do, the wolf will come, so lock the door and fall asleep quickly. If you stay up too late, you won't be able to get to sleep at all. Okay, good night, father. Oh, I thought it was the mother. I was, whatever, who cares? Dad, that's not nice, scary children like that. I mean, you know, every parent does that. They like to say scary things to their children, terrify them into being good. Why do we do that? I guess fear has more power than other things do, but still. <laughs> uh, I don't know who this is, so. So how much more do we have to walk? Hey, Papa, are you listening? You are, right? Hello there, handsome. <laughs> okay. Is this actually someone's papa here? Shut up, Runt. We're almost there. Just be quiet and walk. I'm not Runt. I'm Effie. And stop calling me that. It's getting on my nerves. Oh, you're mean, Papa. Come on, you're always calling yourself different names. Hey, give me a piggyback ride. <sighs> sure, a piggyback ride. That'll be a hundred thousand G. <gasps> Big dummy. Uh, all right. <laughs> The character designs look really cool. See, we're here. And remember, call me Leo here. Uh? Got it. Yeah. Ooh, I can move now. Wow, I can move very quickly. Oh, look, this is so cute. Can I walk anywhere, interact anywhere? Um, what an interesting pair of characters. It seems like they don't know, do, do they know each other that well? I can't tell yet. V? <laughs> or is it you, V, V, V? Oh, okay, v is what she was trying to say. Vermilion. It says Vermilion Town. Ooh, I'm getting cleverer by the day. As long as you don't forget it right away. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay. So, what are we doing now? There's an informant here, so we're gonna sell the info we got at the last town. This town seems to have quite a bit to gleam itself, so we'll look into that. And then go sell that info? Yeah. Also, you shut your trap. What? Okay. Right. First, find... First, a place to stay. Let's try and find some people. 
Okay. I like the music a lot. Anything with like cellos and violins and all that kind of thing. I like that stuff a lot. Feels very fancy. Hmm? Huh? Uh, why are you here? What's the matter to you? Why are you here? It's it's her house. Her house composed of two beds and a table and um, a very decorative looking wardrobe in the back. But don't judge. Just resting my feathers. I'm tired. I'll be fishing for info later. Oh, they know each other? Oh, right. If you find anything about the town's legend, tell me about it, please. You better pay up for it. What do you take me for? Tch. Okay. He gets along with- this Leo guy gets along well with everybody, huh? The shelves are messily packed with things. I like it. It's like multicolored. Reminds me of those kinds of cookies. Looks tasty. Nothing of any real interest. What about this bed? What about this lamp? Eh? Oh, can, we, can we just melt into the bed? Oh, hell yeah! Time to take a nap with this small child. Not weird at all. I'm just gonna get out of here before I get arrested. <laughs> Leo looks like the kind of guy that gets in trouble constantly anyway. I don't think we need to help add to that, add to his list of crimes, huh? He's doing a lot of crime doing right now. I, I don't know what kind of things they're up to. But he's an informant, or inform, what are they called? Information seller person, informant, right? Uh, mm. hmm. Harry, wore a green jacket before, had black hair. What? Oh, okay, so Leo, okay, that's why he goes by so many different names. Because he constantly disguises himself as a different person. Ugh, took me a bit to realize. Changed your whole appearance again, huh? But that scar on your cheek never changes, does... Mm? Who's the kid? I'll tell you later. You know where the residents of this place are? Oh, need a place to stay? Talk to the guy at the largest house... Largest house... Largest house... Wow, that's hard to say. <laughs> largest house in the Northeast. Think the people there are the only real residents. Should lend you a place easy. Okay, I see. Thanks. I'll be back later. Bye now, you too, kid. Hmm? Let's go before she makes this any more of a bother. Okay. There's something here! Got big liar and dragon aura! What is that? What? I got an achievement. Pants on fire! Nothing's inside. What? There's actually things around here? I actually have to look at stuff? I'm afraid. Okay. Okay, I'll search stuff. What, is, what about what's on your desk? It's like apples? Turnips? I don't know what the heck those are. Okay. Hope you guys are doing well today. I think this really uh, complements the the weather, the mood. It's all gloomy and, and rainy outside. I was, I was having a bit of trouble getting out of my bed today. It was just, I don't know, slow day. Feeling kind of bleh. But this is cheering me up. This is nice. The, the music is very calm and steady. Matches everything well. Okay. Um, I guess I don't really need to search all these houses, but I have to! It's it's a game! I gotta search through everything before I progress with the main story, even if there's nothing of substance. I mean, I got I got a book. Are you all are y'all jealous? Are y'all impressed? I know it's okay, don't worry about it. <laughs> Hello there. Hello! Oh, no, speak to me! Speak to me, beautiful creature! Whole lot of different books. Okay. Whole lot of different books. Wow, there is just no one in this library. I love all these empty houses that just have a couple of couple of pieces of furniture in it, huh? Hi there. Oh. Hello. Uh, uh hello. Name's Leo. I'd like to ask you something. Oh, yes, that's perfectly fine. Is there anywhere in town where we could stay? I've got food for us, so a place is all I need. Your travelers? Well, there is a place, yes. My sister and I are the only current residents of this town, you see. That's very unfortunate and strange. So there's all these houses, and there's only two people that are current residents. Okay, but we can freely access any of the houses, just like in any, any RPG. None of these people who... Maybe they've gone away on a trip. Maybe they've gone away in, to war. I don't know, but none of them locked their doors. We just gone and ransacked the place. I mean, it's already empty, so people probably already ransacked it. You can stay anywhere but this house in the library. At no cost, don't worry. Right, thanks for your help. But a few people are renting out houses, so... Well... Uh, I know. The house with the crates outside was just sorted, so it should be usable right away. Just, if you're staying a few days, don't go out late at night. How ominous. What do you mean by that? Uh, what I mean is... Um, <laughs> there's a vicious wolf that goes around at night attacking people. That's very concerning. 
that's probably why nobody's here. They all dead. They've all been eaten by the vicious wolf. Um, right. I see. Take care of yourself. All right, if you need anything, I'll usually be here at home. Oh, yes. Introductions. I'm Keith. Keith Rigfire. Glad to meet you. Keith, is it? Sorry to bother you. Thanks again. Well, I'll be seeing you. Hmm. A wolf? That's scary! So scary! And you're, you're not a traveler, Papa! You're not Leo either, liar! I'm Leo here. Just Leo. Got it, runt. Yeah! D don't- Oh, okay. Oh, not yeah. It was yeah! <laughs> like, oh my god! Yeah! D don't yell at me! Okay, got it, Leo. Good. I got a place to crash, so let's go to the informant. Okay, uh, that's probably the girl, right? The girl with the big hair? Well, I'm gonna check out everywhere first. Very important, very essential stuff. Great, a vicious wolf is running around attacking everybody. Is this the vicious wolf? The heck is this? What is this? I can't tell what it is. That was, oh, um, I'm gonna go ahead and lie because this game is called Lie Eat. So let's lie at it. Wow. What's going on? <laughs> What's happening? Um, okay, let's look at our skills, huh? We've got special skill of throwing a knife. Uh, that sh feels like it should just be a regular attack. And we've got an electrifying attack, a stun gun. <laughs> so like if I had a sandwich in my inventory, it's like bait. Like it's like uh, giving fancy names to just regular items in your inventory. All right, well, I mean, these are weapons. These are weapons, so makes sense that they'd be skills. You'd have to be skilled to wield them. All right, let's just attack. Uh, what's your skills? Nothing. You ain't skilled at anything. Oh, snap. Ow! Ow! <laughs> I like all these little papping sounds like pat, pat. Okay. Stay still. What? What was that? Did I press some um, do nothing on accident? That's weird. Let's knife it! Ouch! Oh my god, how much health does this thing have? Oh no! Athena's gonna die! Oh Christ, okay. Okay, that was interesting. <laughs> I'm sorry, did no, no one warned me about this random creature? I'm sorry, what if I had truthed it? Uh, all right, well, let's just, um, let's not concern ourselves with that little thing. <laughs> what the frick? Um, I hope somebody says something because that was weird. Got a room? Yeah, now let's get down to business to defeat the Huns. Right, right, I've been looking forward to this. Hmm, so the bluebird really does exist. Yeah, couldn't capture it, but good enough, right? And you brought a feather! That and the info is enough for me. Here's your reward. So, I heard you came upon a dragon egg. Egg. Is it true? Yeah, about that. Her. Huh? Hmm? She hatched from the egg. I still don't get it either. You serious? Really? For real? <clears throat> Eek! Okay, I have to- okay, I have to- she's- okay, the dragon is scared of him, so I have to- I have to take that into account. Watch it, mister! Gotta be nice to girls, okay? Aww! <laughs> Cute! Like this! Everyone has such interesting character designs, I really like them. Yeah! Oh no, she didn't like that. <clears throat> I'm just gonna ignore the fact that you totally slapped me away, even though I was just trying to be affectionate, so... What kind of dragon is she? Thunder? Amoeba? Amoeba dragon sounds very non-threatening compared to a thunder dragon. She eats lies. That's her diet. And she can breathe fire, kinda. It'd be faster to show you. Um... Hey, Runtling. That's Effie to you! Well, you see, Effie, me and him are brother and sister. Oh, okay. No way! Yep, I lied. Oh, ooh, and now what? She gets physical. Okay, but also you do too. It looks like you can attack them, but I guess she eats them all. She's dying. Uh, whoa, we have a li lies with every breath. Dunno. Go! <laughs> okay, very useful. It doesn't look like I can use them right now. All right. She's gonna die, dude. Holy crap, use your skill, stun gun it. Oh no, she's gonna die in one more. Okay, Jesus Christ, how do we heal? Okay. I see, I see. That was faster to show me. 
Never heard of, and definitely never seen a dragon like this before. Huh, really? So not even you? But that's about it for now. I'm exhausted from walking. Gotcha. If it's okay by you, I'd pay a pretty penny for this kid. Uh? The runt's not for sale. I'll sell you info on her, maybe. Greedy, greedy! <laughs> Why'd you pick this town to do business in, anyway? It's so inconvenient to reach, and I don't think the value of the info's worth it. <laughs> well, if that vampire legend is true, it'd be worth my time, yes? Vampires? <laughs> don't go chasing fairy tales! I'd sooner consider dragons the fairy tales myself. I'm told their bloodline ended a long time ago, but I'm sure I'm right. Says who? Says my gut. Hmm. Well, if anything comes up, I'll help with what I can. At a price, of course. Right. See ya. Okay. Um... What, did you say anything else? A dragon with a diet of lies. Hmm. Very interesting. Okay. That is interesting. So, I, I, I don't really... Why are there physical manifestations of them? Why was there one just floating next to a building and just making random sounds? Can other... So people can see them. Can people always see lies? Do they always have a physical manifestation? And if that's the case, then you can tell when someone's lying, right? Unless it only pops up because of like a power that she has or something, huh? Can you sell dragons? Uh, oh, oh <laughs> uh, well, they're rare. They got sturdy bodies, so they can fetch a good price. Mainly as slaves. No, that's not cool. That ain't cool. Slaves? Anyways, look into it yourself if you want to know. I've got things to do. You can go off and play. Just don't leave the town. Don't go anywhere strange. And here's a snack for later. Okay! Hooray! Okay, we're by ourselves. Afina. Okay. Uh, ooh. Wasn't the... Was the girl in this one? Other girl. Hello? Hi there. Hmm? All alone now? Effie is alone now! Oh, well, want to talk with me for a bit? Shall I tell the story of the butterfly whose flapping caused a tornado? The butterfly effect? <laughs> or perhaps the story of the dreaming illness? For money, right? <laughs> then no thanks! He taught you well, hmm? Huh? Uh, right. If you're bored, would you call my partner here for me? He should be in the library. His name is Levin, recognizable by being a cat. Okay! Please and thank you! Alright. I do like the cat person. He looked very cool. Uh, the library was here, right? Uh, nope. Nope, this is somewhere else entirely. Hi there. Oh. Oh, God, I did, I'm bad with voices. It's gone dark, hasn't it? The day's ending again. Okay. A stuffed rabbit. Nothing's inside. Ooh, something's gotta be inside one of these things. There's candy here! Ooh. Mmm... I don't know, that makes it seem kind of bad. You know how in like other games you can just take stuff from other people's houses, but this makes it seem kind of bad. Hmm, that's okay. We can take it later if we really need to. Hi, are you the sister? Not supposed to talk to people. Okay, that's weird. That, I don't know why you should be told to not talk to people. Seems like a weird abusive relationship. Think you should get the heck out of here. I'm watching you. Maybe I should take your candy, hmm? What are you doing to your sister? Uh, presumably your sister. Hey, this frame, it's crooked. It's off kilter, can I fix it? Gosh dang it all. Okay. How about the center door right here? What? A uh, candle. A candle, excuse me, several candles uh, forming a candelabra. Seasonings and other things, okay. Oh. Ooh, a locked door, huh? Mm, is there a key for that around here? I'd like to snoop around your house. Okay, can I read your private notes? Nope, okay. This was the library, I'm assuming? Hi there, oh, there's a new person. Who are you? Oh wait, it's you. <laughs> what, you wanna play or something? Uh, not really, I don't, you're smelly. Nah, I can make my own fun. Is that right? Yeah, you suck, quote-unquote Leo, whatever your real name is. Um, are you Mr. Levin? Yes, and? Oh, well, I, uh, I don't actually know her name, huh? The lady with the crazy hair who goes Tch, a bunch call for you. Oh, you mean Rosalie, I see. Thank you very much. Excuse me. That's settled then, I guess. Favorite complete. Okay, what's next? 
Mm. Who else can we talk to? Well, I guess we, we could just talk to Leo again, but I'd rather see if she says anything now that they're together. So then. Yes. Hmm. What are you discussing? I'd like to be a part of your discussion. Please? Hey guys, what are you talking about? Hmm? Hmm? Hi! I can fly around the room really fast. Check this out. It's super awesome. Okay, you're boring. See you later. I, I love how speedy the movement is in this game. It's really funny. Who do we talk to? I mean, I guess we could just talk to him again, but I feel like I feel like I should talk to the few people that are here. Let me check out this house again really quick. Would you say anything else? Uh, oh, uh, on your own now? The town doesn't have much in the way of places to play, so it must be boring for a child. Effie's not a child, so I'm not bored. Is that right? Pardon me. Oh, she's hungry. Uh -huh. Oh my. Would you like something to eat? I like making sweets so I could whip something up. Yay! I love sweets! Oh, they won't make me full, though. Are you of a race that only eats something in particular? Yeah! Hey, mister, tell a lie for me! A lie? I was cleaning until just now. After that, I did some reading. And I finished making dinner a little while ago. <laughs> uh, what are these? Yeah, I guess she makes physical manifestations of them appear. Uh, now I punch him! Which one's the lie? Uh, hmm, which is it? Oh, I have to, like, look around? Oh, crap! So he was cleaning until just now, and he was doing some writing, and then he already finished making dinner, is what he said. So I can actually search around the house? Oh, okay, that's why we could look around and see what he was doing. Okay, let's try and find out which one's the lie in the next episode. What do you guys think? This is this is really cute and interesting so far. Um, I, I figure it's not gonna be super long, but uh, I'm having a great time with it. I, I just have a really soft spot for RPG Maker games, honestly. Um, I think Paper and I have mentioned it a couple times before, but we we just had this phase where we played through so many of them, just whatever we could find. All the classics, yeah, you know, like Mad Father, Misao, um, uh, what, what the heck was that one called? Uh, Corpse Party? We just like looked for all the scary ones, uh, Witch's House, stuff like that. So anyways, this is fun. This one seems a lot cuter in comparison, much less scary. Let's keep going with Light Eat. I'll see you then. This is Axis, over and out.